Well, if you uh, don't mind living near the railroad tracks, I've got some uh, interesting th something interesting to show you. Some houses here, model homes. Well, these are not model homes; they're actually the homes for sale. Let's look at the uh, advertisement first. I'm just walking along the street, and I'm sorry to turn the camera so much there. And I saw the uh, this advertisement here, this billboard here next to these little places. Let's take a look. These are brand new homes. You don't see a lot of. Uh, well, there's another train. There's a bullet train, so you really are close to the tracks. But um, these are, uh, there's not a lot of, you don't see a lot of track homes in Japan. Mostly people have them built, uh, custom built. They buy a piece of land and have the home built. But this is an example of a builder, uh, you know, taking advantage of a good opportunity with some vacant lots, uh, farm lots, and made these houses. These are, uh, this looks like a 3LDK here. That's uh, three bedrooms, living room, dining room, and kitchen. Doesn't say the price on it. This is made by a Pana home. It's a pretty uh, well known builder here. And uh, here's another one over here. This is also a 3LDK, another Pana home. And uh, they're pretty tight, close in together. You got the phone number there if you want. This is, you can get the Pana home uh, a name and you know, a little logo there. No one's living here yet, so you know, as far as anyone thinks, I could be just uh, a guy interested in buying. And there are actually four units here. Here's the second one here. Actually, someone actually lives in that one. This is pretty good, uh, three parking spots. That's pretty rare. Uh, it was actually two parking spots and something for bicycles, I guess. Typical uh, shutters like you see in houses in Japan. Let's go on over here and take a look at the ones in back. I wonder if some of those parking are for these guys back here. Probably not. Oh wait, someone might be living here. Look at this car there. There's a third third, and then a fourth unit right there. Still, I could be a, uh, an interested party, huh? Well, I think, I wonder if someone lives there. I don't want to film people's house if they live in it, <laughs> but I'll just step back. Imagine I'm a, an interested party. Oh, there's another parking lot space back there, and then the fourth house back there. This is all in about the size of a, overall, the size of this lot. I would say that is a little smaller, four homes on a space a little smaller than you would find in a track home in California, where I'm from. So you can really pack them in uh, close here, and, and as you can see, there's lots of uh, train activity, so you'd have to... Uh, live with a lot of train noise from the uh, JR trunk line and the uh, bullet train tracks there above. But not a bad place to live. This is actually a very desirable area. I'm sure these are expensive. Well, thanks for dropping by and having a look at a couple of, pan of uh, Pana homes here in Shizuka, Japan. Bye-bye.